Hey guys, it's Renee. So today we're going to be making this school and office supply organizer and I'm going to be sharing with you two options. So it's kind of gross, but I'm going to be using this three cardboard toilet paper rolls. If you find this kind of gross, just feel free to work with a kitchen towel cardboard roll. And I'm going to be using this foam sheet. So I'm just going to be marking my roll on like my foam sheet, but I'm going to be marking a bit more of that because I want this to be higher. And then I'm going to be using my ruler and I'm going to mark a line across that just to make this even. Then I'm going to cut that. So it's going to be pretty much per roll. I need two more. I'm going to be hot gluing this and then just cutting out the excess. It's pretty much like the part where it's going to be like different for everybody. This top, for instance, I like the print, but doesn't fit me at all. So I'm just going to be using this. Now I'm sharing this project using our clothes because I think most of us have that one top skirt dress that we don't use ever but we like to print on it. Maybe you don't have like florals, maybe you have something else and you want to recycle and put it to better use. This is a good option for it. Pretty much I'm telling you it's going to be cutting this and I'm just going to be pretty much using the back of this top where there's no details. I'm just going to be taking my hot glue gun again and I'm just going to pretty much wrap the whole thing. I burned myself a few times, not going to lie here because the fabric is too thin. This is one of the reasons that I never wore it because I I had to wear something underneath it and I'm a simple girl I just can't do layers in summertime feel free to work with other kinds of glues I tend to work with a hot glue gun because it dries faster so then I took my glass by school B and my uh, brush this was once a concealer brush but I always use it for like painting and I just did two layers of this because it felt a bit too fabricy for me I wanted the whole thing to be harder and I did use white glue with some water just to uh, see if there was any difference and it's not they look the same to make this stand up i'm going to be using this piece of cardboard and i'm just going to make sure that there's enough space for the three of those guys then i went ahead and painted this with this vintage white in my brush again but later on i changed my mind but i really recommend you now to choose if you want to go for a lighter color or a darker one because it's easier to paint the whole thing just like this and then it's time to glue my tubes for that i'm going to be marking first the center of this and i'm just going to be pretty much glued then i'm marking like the middle part of those two like the edge and the tube gluing that and i did the same for the other part then i decided to add some like details with my hot glue gun my plan was to go for this border like they you know decorate cakes with the frosting and the border it doesn't look as neat as those cakes because well this is a hot glue gun and uh, the frosting is like hard i went ahead and painted this and i think that border pretty much adds a detail that was missing before and this is pretty much what this one with the lighter base looks like. I think it looks really cute. Again, you can use whatever like fabric that you find. Or if you don't have any clothes that you don't wear, just, you know, get a piece of fabric that you like. And it's pretty much the same. I think this one looks amazing for lighter or just white desks. However, I don't have a white desk. Mine is like this wooden desk. So I just went ahead and used this black acrylic paint, my two brushes and pretty much just got rid of like the whole white part i know it's a shame because it's a waste of paint kind of mad at myself that i wasted all that white but i think the black base looks much better for my desk and yeah this is pretty much what the black one looks like i think it looks a lot better with the flowers and the white and the black and this is my desk so the white base was like too contrasty for the whole thing these are the two ideas that i want to share with you i like them both but again the white one looks better for lighter desks i think and the darker one looks better for uh, like black or just like desks like mine this is a pretty affordable where you can just recycle but yeah i really hope you and this helped and you like this if you did don't forget to give this video a thumbs up check out more DIYs that i have on my channel and subscribe for more thank you so much for watching i'll talk to you later and take care Bye.